Hey, just before I go to my dance class, I wanted to say something what I feel is interesting uh, between dance and expression in, in dance and, and yoga. And this is something I, I get from my flam flamenco, flamenco teacher, Patricio. Uh, I once asked him uh, in a dance that how should I, what should I do with my, my arms? And he stopped and he was like, how can I tell you what you do with your arms? So do how you feel you should do. And, and this is important because then I realized that, yeah, he can't tell me like, do like this, but it's something much more deeper, uh, much deeper in me that it's an expression of my heart and my body and my, my arms go because my expression, my feeling is such. And um, I feel this is something that is missing in yoga very often, in the asana practice. That I see people uh, practicing asanas with a very serious face, also with a very serious attitude, and without really an expression of their body or of their heart. It's just repetition. And... Uh, I don't know why it's like this. Is it like you think you shouldn't feel anything while you're practicing yoga? You should be so neutral that no, no expression is, is possible. But I think that uh, all the adjustments and all kind of uh, alignments are unnecessary. Because if you really feel your body, you are in your body and you know how you want to do or you, how your body does it. You're not asking, is it this way or this way? You go and you do and you feel and you, of course, you can adjust. Uh, you change things, but it's according to your feeling and not, not according to someone's opinion. Um, yeah, so I think this can also give you something in your asana practice. If you allow an expression from deep inside that how do you want how do you feel that this asana is what it what is it for you and of course this changes during the years but just right now what is your asana how do you feel and then just do be free